Yeah, I think that's better. Good morning, my loving Tiffany Thinks family. How are you all? I am going to the hospital. Well, I'm getting ready to go to the hospital today. Hold on, let me get down these stairs. Look at me coming down the stairs without even having to hold onto the rail. Good morning, my loving Tiffany Thinks family. How are you all? We have an appointment today. Um, I have an appointment today with the CNS nurse. So I still have all these like wounds and areas at my top and my back and my bottom, like that area, needs to be checked out because um, I think there's areas that haven't be been healed over. Oh, are you gonna come in and say hello? Oh, soft. Yeah, that's really cozy, that's cozy, yeah. Amma's here, give him, say good, good morning. morning. Amma's wearing the blue, we got this t-shirt. I'm actually gonna put my hoodie on today. Yeah. I'm wearing my black, we got this hoodie. Let me put that on now. Oh, cozy, cozy, cozy. I always say whenever we go to the hospital, we've got to wear the We Got This merch. If you want one, there's always a link down in the description box below. And I just want to say thank you to those of you that have bought one um, and like send me in pictures and things. I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. It honestly makes me so happy because when I see you, sometimes you send me in you and your mum wearing the We Got This and I'm always like, like thank you, just thank you. Yeah, we've got the appointment today in the morning um, to see the CNS nurse. We got the news that I'm clear, right? So the scans are all clear. The CT CAP scan and the MRI scan came out as clear. And I feel like me, Alma and Matt, we've had time to process it. And it's honestly like, I still can't get my head around it. And I think for me, I think Alma and Matt, like, are different to how I'm reacting to it because for me I think where I'm still so sore from the surgery and still like not able to walk like the way I normally walk I just like take my time but I am a lot better than I used to be like I can come down the stairs without holding the rail like you would have seen so um, I am a lot better and I am seeing an improvement each day now like I am seeing an improvement but where I'm still like very sore and I can't sit down and I think that's why I'm I think that's why I'm not reacting the way I should be like I should be jumping up and down but I can't even I can't jump so I think and also it doesn't feel like I think where we always go and we always have like bad news right we always go see the doctors they would say oh you've got chemo you need to do extra amount of chemo you need to do more radiotherapy or you need to do radiotherapy before surgery and then like each time it's felt like we were getting bad news, bad news, bad news. And even, do you remember when in August, when they said, oh, you don't need to have surgery now? We were a bit like, we were happy. We were like, oh yeah, great. We don't need to do the surgery now. Like, and then all of a sudden I had to do the surgery. So it was just like, I don't know. I feel like I need, I need more time, I think, to process everything that's gone on. And... I need to get better in myself, but I am buzzing. Honestly, it doesn't feel real. I am, I, I am buzzing. Of course, I'm the happiest girl. It's just I need to accept it now. I need to accept it. I don't know. Have you ever like been in a situation, whether it's your health or I don't know. Like, have you ever been to a similar situation to me? I don't know if this is like a normal reaction. I spoke to one of you on Instagram, one of the Tiffany Thinks family and um, you were saying that you felt like that, you felt like you didn't want to believe it because you're so used to expecting like bad news and I think that's where I am, like I feel like if I celebrate, I don't know, I feel a bit like oh, like I don't know what's going to happen but I don't want to live like that, I don't want to live like what, what if, you know, what if the next scans come up as different results so that's what I'm kind of juggling with in my mind. What time is it? Yeah, I should leave now. I should leave. I'm gonna come back and make myself a coffee. I think I'm gonna treat myself to a coffee when I come back. You know last year, yeah, so you know last year in 2022, I was having coffees all the time. Whereas now I'm using a, like coffee as a treat. I drink tea every single day, but coffee is like a treat because I feel like I don't know, I don't know why, I just feel like coffee is like my treat and tea, tea is a must, you know, you have to have tea every day. <laughs> Let's go. Before we go, I'm gonna put on some earrings. I think I need some earrings. 
I like these little hoops. I'm just wearing these little hoops. It looks like a lovely day outside, which is nice. It looks nice, but I bet you it's very, very cold. Painted my nails the other day. But they're all chipping away. Okay, earrings in. Let's go. I think once I can sit up, right, I want to go to the hairdressers because my hair just looks a bit blah. Like I just want to get layers in, you know? I want to, I just need a haircut. I haven't had a haircut in so long. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Got my lip balm and got my phone. And I've got all the bits in the car. I kept my blood test forms here in the car. I'm in the car, I'm in the car. It's still sitting on my side. Okay, I'm in. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. Yeah, I've got my blood tests in the car here. Oh my goodness, hold on, I need to reposition. Okay, I think that's better. Yeah, I've got my blood test here in the car. Um, but what I'm going to do, well, what the doctor said is, don't get it done now, get it done. You know when I'm going to have my next set of scans? So when I have another set of scans, in like six, five to six weeks, um, in six weeks, I think it's five weeks now, um, then I'm gonna go and do the blood test because they've just recently done a blood test so it won't be much different. But last time they said my tumor markers were like normal levels. So also, also I've got a cold sore here that's not going away, which I'm gonna come back and put a little compete sticker on it again. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try and figure out this bum situation whilst no, I'm comfortable like this, Emma. This is perfect. <laughs> Here to see the CNS nest. Tick, tick, tick. <laughs> we found parking right at the end there. Um, I can't believe it's early morning and the car park, it's full. It's full, full, full. Um, no, Amma and I, we were talking in the car and we're saying, even though like the scans are all like free like all clear we're still like having to come to the hospital like on monday i have an appointment with the medical team so the doctor from the medical team and then after that we get a little break i don't have any other appointments so i guess then it'll feel like then it will hit us because i think now because where we're coming to the hospital seeing doctors and nurses um Oh, there's a car park spot yeah, here. Yeah. <laughs> Look, there's a spot right here, right in front of the hospital now that we've parked all the way at the top. <laughs> yeah, I think once um, we don't come to the hospital as much, then it will feel all real again. Like, it'll feel like, oh my goodness, you know? It's actually a lovely day today. Cold. Are you cold? I'm not cold because you know what? I'm always hot. Like my body is always hot. It's actually lovely. I like it. Hi, I have an appointment today. Yeah. I need to, I forgot, the nurse did tell me to come down to the radiotherapy reception area. I went to the outpatients, so I need to go all the way down to where I used to have the radiotherapy. Oh. <laughs> did you guys, have you guys been here since I had like, you know when I was coming to have radiotherapy like every single day? Um, that was mad, wasn't it? That was mad, wasn't it? Like I had radiotherapy, like, oh my goodness. <laughs> I haven't been back there in a long time, so yeah, let's go. You know the place, don't you? Yeah. That's why, you know when I was like in hospital and because I like, because I filmed my, um, like the whole journey, that's why I felt like I needed you to see everything that was going on in the hospital as well. And obviously it always helps me talking to you. But um, I wasn't going to put out the hospital videos, but then you were with me through... Oh, is it working? Yeah. You were with me through everything, like with chemo, all the lighting's awful, through chemo, radiotherapy, surgery. So it just, yeah, you were with me through the whole journey. The whole journey. And so are you, Amma. 
I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. This is the room. Um, the nurse, she just took the stitches out of my bottom. So I think it's the final lot of stitches, I think. Um, yeah, she's like put rune dressings on it as well. So I think I'm gonna have to come see her in a few weeks. She's gonna get her diary so she can book me in. But she did say everything's kind of healing over nicely, which is good news, very good news. That's really, really good. <laughs> Is it ground floor? Yeah, ground floor. Thanks. Okay, I'm gonna go to the car now. We got this, we got this. We're out of the hospital, we're out of the hospital. My bum feels lighter. I think where she's taken the stitches out, um, yeah, oh well, my bum feels a lot lighter. <laughs> it does, it, honestly. I think there was a lot of stitches that needed to come out and she's taken them out, which is good um, because it just means that I can, I'm not waddling as much. It just feels like I can walk a little bit better. Um, hold on, sorry. I spoke to the nurse about, you know, like how I, like I can't, I don't feel like I can celebrate. I feel a bit, you know, I feel like I can't celebrate the results and things and she goes you know what this is so common like she goes people who have been given clear like scan results they don't like they don't know how to respond and it's because um, she said it's like the fear of people worry about it coming back and so that's why people are too scared to celebrate she said like it's normal to have that anxiety but right now it's not something I should be thinking about like I should just think today I'm cancer free so Let's go home and get a coffee. It's not like we can go to the coffee shop or anything because I still can't sit on my bottom. Still can't sit on my bottom. <laughs> She's given more of these. Um, it's called Aquacel Extra. And she's given more of the wound gel as well. So she's given more of these as well. So that will be for all the wounds. Okay, gonna get into the car now. We're quickly going to my auntie's house, so it's around the corner and my sister's there with Ella, so we said we'll quickly come and say hi to them. Um, I don't mind going to my auntie's house because she's got all this sofa that I can like lie on if I need to, so like last time I went there, you guys know, you know when I got my, um, what results, my, you know when we needed to find out about the margins and then we all went to my auntie's house i don't mind going to my auntie's house because like her sofa i can just lie on her sofa if i need to and i don't feel like yeah i'm allowed to do that like she won't mind so um yeah I'm gonna go there now we left my auntie's house i'm so tired i'm gonna fall asleep in the back of the car i'm so 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 tired today had a little nap in the car to so feel a little bit refreshed. Hi, my darling. Hello. Hi, darling. Hello. Hi, darling. I really, really missed you, darling. Did you? I did. I did. Very, very hungry now. Ooh. Cup of tea. Mm. Emma, you want a cup of tea? Yeah. What did you do? I don't oh, want to talk. Mean? I don't want to talk. I'm tired and hungry. It's nice, isn't it? So good. The plan was to go to the hospital and then to come back but then we quickly went to my auntie's and then we stayed there a little bit longer than we anticipated um, but come home to a per perfect lunch we've got sandwiches we've got a chicken sandwich we've got onion rings it's just incredible so so nice I can't wait should I take a bite of the sandwich yeah, of what is nice. oh, this is a big old sandwich take a bite okay this is an egg mayo pepper salt that's it isn't it a mayo just egg mayo no. egg mayonnaise sandwich mm -hmm. are you that's kidding me look at this sad. you've got a chicken you've, so you've got a chia batter you've got lettuce mayo oh, let me focus on that you've got an onion ring you've got a chicken and spicy then, chicken oh 
much. I am. I love food. You know what? I actually love food. Because in no in hospital you don't get like I was on the NG tube and all that. So now I'm like honestly the biggest foodie. Mm. I'm honestly the happiest girl, darling. Thank you so much. Thank you. Darling, this is all I want for the rest of my life. Sandwiches. What? That sandwich? Sandwiches. That's all I want from you. Nothing else. That's beautiful, that one, That's... Do you want another bite? No. I am super, super cosy. I'm going to make a cup of, cup of coffee. What is this going on in my hair? Yeah, I'm going to make a coffee now. I needed to change my battery on my camera. Am I in focus? Yeah, I needed to change my camera on my battery. I took my gown on, because gown off, because it was so, so hot. Is it a good coffee? Yeah. You know what I did today? I put a little bit of sugar in there. Mm -mm -mm. Sugar at the bottom. Sugar at the end. At the end? At the end, just. Mix it together with a spoon, with a spoon. I'm gonna get a little biscuit for my coffee. I, took, I had my gown on, and then whilst I was making the coffee, I was like, oh, I need to take this gown off, it's too hot. I'm gonna have one of these, my fave biscuits, I love them. And the nest do one like this, but I prefer the boxes. I really like this. Mm. It's a little bit later and we've decided we want to go to see my darling Astin, go and see my little nephew. Shall I show them what we're bringing him? Oh yeah, we need to give that as well. <laughs> we've got little things to take for him, to him. We've got like a colouring book, but I know, oops, sorry, this is not flattering. I know he's going to love this. He loves white chocolate. So I'm going to take him this, I'm going to take him some stickers as well. And we've just got little bits and bobs like colouring pencils, colouring book. So, I think that'll be nice. Okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Um, uh, Matt and I. An apple. Apple. Mm. Apple. Do you know what that is? What? No, Orange. That? Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I'm yeah, sure some of you will know. Hey, apple. Do you know that, darling? No, what's hey. that? Hey, apple. If you know, let us know. If you know, some of you might know. Yeah. Amma, do you know this? Hey, apple. Hey, Apple. hey, Apple. Is that all the ones? No one knows what I'm talking about. Hi, my Hello. baby. Hello. 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 Hi, baby. Hello. Matt and I just got home. Amma decided to stay at my sister's tonight. We honestly had such a lovely time at my sister's with everyone, so it was really, really good. I don't even think I picked up my camera that much. Did I? I don't think I did. So yeah, sorry about that. I didn't pick up the camera. I was just kind of in the moment and it was honestly incredible. I put my ring back on as well. I've also got this one on that my sister gave me for my birthday. Yeah, I just don't know why I felt like I needed to tell you. Yeah, I'm gonna go upstairs now and get changed into my PJs. My cozy clothes. I need to show you guys. So Matt got some new bedding and he made the bed. I wanna show you. Can you see? Like, look at this bedding. It's got like little giraffes on it, like little cute giraffes. <laughs> I love that he did that because when I went to the appointment today to see the CNS nurse, I came home and I saw this bedding and I was like, oh, this is like, it's not something I would have picked, but I like it. I really, really like it. It's really nice material. Um, I'm so excited to get into bed today. It looks so good. Like, I just want to jump in now. You're tired. Yeah. Do you know what was really good about today, right? So it got late, it got it got late, and then I was getting really sleepy. But then Aston told us to come over, and I was just thinking, right? If we didn't go tonight, like we wouldn't have had this like really nice time with them. And I feel like that's what I want. I just want memories, and yeah, that's what I'm doing, making memories. I just washed my face, and you know what I've been using? You know E45. That's what I've been using on my face because I feel like, I don't know, I feel like my skin is super, super dry and E45 is like, it has nothing in it. It's just, I feel like with E45, I used to use it when I was younger and then I started using like Body Shop and other creams and then, yeah, now I've just gone back to E45. So I'm going to put that on and then go downstairs and meet my darling downstairs. I think we've got loads of episodes of The Apprentice to watch. So, um... 
we'll do that tonight let me get a little bit of e45 sorry the lighting in here sorry the lighting in here is not the best but yeah um i feel like e45 is good do you have a special night cream that you use and if you do please like can you recommend me one because i have really really dry skin i feel like it's super super dry and even when I touch it, like, I don't know, maybe I need to drink a bit more water. Okay, I'm just going to let that sit on there. Even with my neck, my neck, let me put my glasses on. My neck is kind of clearing up a little bit. A little bit, not really, I'm not going to lie, it looks pretty much... Let me get some lighting on it. It doesn't really matter. I guess if anyone asks, no one has asked me, to be honest, and I feel like the people who know me know that I've had, like, I've had wires connected to me, tubes and everything. So you know what? It's fine. It's kind of like my tattoo. And if anyone does ask me, I'll just say, listen, your girl beat cancer. So I don't care about any of this. <laughs> my darling's having cereal. Mm -hmm. He's having Kellogg's. This is my favorite. Is this cereal. your favorite cereal? Oh. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, you do ride this all the time. I feel like, yeah. Do you put any sugar or anything on top? No. Frosties. I think Frosties is my fave. I don't know. I go. I don't know. I'm. Do you want I, no. Oh, you want that? No, thank you. Bonjour. I go through phases where I love cereal and I have it every night, and then there's times where I just don't want it. I just wanted to come on here and say good night to you all. I'm gonna drink lots of water, darling, because I feel like everything feels dry. So I'm gonna drink lots of water. I've got my bottle of water here. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go sleep. Thank you all so much for everything as always thank you thank you thank you i love you a lot a lot a lot if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and join my loving tiffany thanks family we're growing every single day and i will see you in my next video instagram facebook and tiktok is tiffany thanks bye Mwah. good night daddy you want to say good night good night good night everybody <laughs>